Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Today we are going to discuss about uh, bearing. Bearing and their types. Okay. So first uh, we are going to define what is bearing. Bearing is an angle between meridian and survey line. It is an angle between meridian and uh, survey line. You know that uh, this is our north, south, east and west. If we find and calculate the angle of any survey line with respect to north-south direction, then that angle is known as a bearing. For example, we have north-south, that is our direction, and this is our survey line, AB. The angle between north direction and survey line, which is theta, so this theta is known as a bearing. Now, what are the types of bearing? There are three types of bearing. Three types. True bearing, magnetic bearing, and arbitrary bearing. Now what is true bearing? An angle between a line and true meridian is known as a true bearing. An angle between true north, true north and survey line. Survey line is called a true bearing. True north ke saath survey line jo angle banai, us angle ko kete hai true bearing. True north are geographic line just okay there we represent that from t and t n and t s true north and true south and the line which makes an angle of theta with the true north and true south so this theta this is called a true bearing true bearing now what is magnetic bearing uh, bearing an angle between a line and magnetic meridian is known as a magnetic bearing. A magnetic bearing kya hota hai? Agar true, agar magnetic north ke saath koi bhi survey line angle banaye, to usko kete hai magnetic bearing. Usko simply aap log jo hai bearing bhi kete hai simply. Sahi hai simply. Isko bearing bhi kete hai. To magnetic meridian kya hota hai? अगर मैग्नेटिक मेरिडियन के साथ जो है मैग्नेटिक मेरिडियन के साथ कोई सर्वे लाइन आपका एंगल बनाए तो उसको कहते हैं मैग्नेटिक बेरिंग और सिंपली बेरिंग तो सबसे पहले डिस्कस करते हैं कि व्हाट इज अ मैग्नेटिक मेरिडियन मैग्नेटिक मेरिडियन इज डेट या मैग्नेटिक नॉर्थ ये वो मैग्नेटिक वो है जो अगर आप कोई भी मैग्नेट को आजादाना तौर पर सस्पेंड करते हैं यू आर प्रेजेंट सस्पेंडेड द मैग्नेट एंड इट पॉइंटेड टुवर्ड्स द नॉर्थ एंड साउथ डायरेक्शन सो दैट डायरेक्शन विल बी नोन एज अ मैग्नेटिक नॉर्थ और मैग्नेटिक मेरिडियन so, if any survey line which makes an angle with this direction, that's called a magnetic bearing. Or simply that is called a bearing. So, or magnetic, uh, that will be inclined to the two north. Okay. So, we will represent this line by MN. MN means magnetic north and magnetic south. So, this angle, this angle, which is uh, our survey line AB, this angle, which is alpha, so that alpha will be called magnetic magnetic bearing or simply magnetic bearing almost jitne bhi works hote hai practically jitne bhi bearing calculate ki jati hai aur jo sara calculation kiya jata hai wo is magnetic bearing ki buniyad pe hota hai teesra type hai arbitrary meridian Arbitrary meridian kya hai? An angle between a line and any arbitrary meridian is called arbitrary bearing.
आर्बिटर बियरिंग ये है कि कोई भी अगर आपको मैग्नेटिक नॉर्थ और मैग्नेटिक साउथ का पता नहीं है आपको ट्रू बियरिंग आपको ट्रू मेरेडियन और मैग्नेटिक मेरेडियन का पता नहीं है और आप अपने लिए जो है एक आर्बिटरी डायरेक्शन सेलेक्ट करते हैं और उसको आप नार देते हैं कोई भी ये क्या डायरेक्शन है ये है आर बेटररी लाइन सो विद दिस लाइन ऐसा वे मैं ऐसा वे लाइन विच मेक्स एन एंगल ऑफ ट्विटा दैट ट्विटा विल बी नोन एज आर बेटररी बेयरिंग विद रेस्पेक्ट टू टेकिंग बेयरिंग देर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ बेयरिंग जब आप बेयरिंग लेते हैं तो इस लिहाज से बेयरिंग के दो टाइप्स है एक कहलाता है फोर बेयरिंग फोर बेयरिंग और दूसरा है बेक बेयरिंग इसको मुख्तर तौर पर जाहिर करते हैं एफ बी से और उसको जाहिर किया जाता है बी बी से बेक बेयरिंग वट इज अ फोर बेयरिंग उर्दू में उसको आप इस तरह डिफाइन कर सकते हैं लाइन के स्टार्ट में लाइन के आगाज में ली जाने वाली पहली रीडिंग को फोर बेयरिंग कहा जाता है और लाइन के अख्ताम पे ली जाने वाली दूसरी रीडिंग रीडिंग इसको कहते हैं बैक बेयरिंग अंग्रेजी में आप उसको इस तरह डिफाइन कर सकते हैं द बियरिंग ऑब्जर्वेट एट द स्टार्ट पॉइंट ऑफ लाइन इस कार्ड ऑफ फोर बेयरिंग द बियरिंग ऑब्जर्वेट एट द स्टार एट द स्टार एट द स्टार्ट आप लाइन यहाँ पे आप देखते दी फर्स्ट ये इसमें शर्त है दी फर्स्ट बियरिंग ऑब्जर्वेट एट द स्टार्ट ऑफ लाइन इज नोन एज फोर बियरिंग लाइन के आगाज में ली जाने वाली पहली रीडिंग को कहते हैं फोर बियरिंग जब एक बैक बियरिंग को इस तरह डिफाइन किया सकता है दी सेकंड बियरिंग द सेकंड बियरिंग टेकन एट द एंड ऑफ लाइन एट द एंड ऑफ लाइन इस कार्ड बैक बेयरिंग लाइन के अख्ताम पे ली जाने वाली दूसरी रीडिंग इसको कहा कहते हैं फोर बेयरिंग बैक बेयरिंग अच्छा इसको अब फिगर से किस तरह जाहिर करेंगे यहाँ पे देखिए ये आपके पास क्या चीज़ है नॉर्थ साउथ ईस्ट एंड वेस्ट असल में ये चीज़ क्या है असल में ये चीज़ जो है इसको दिस रिप्रजेंट कम्पस दिस रिप्रजेंट कम्पस ये कम्पस का सिम्बल है कम्पस का सिम्बल है नॉर्थ साउथ ईस्ट वेस्ट वेस्ट ओके दिस इज कम्पस सिम्बल एंड कम्पस इज एन डिवाइस बाई विच वी डिटर्मिन बियरिंग सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल एंड दिस इज ऑल लाइन ए बी नॉर्थ साउथ ईस्ट एंड वेस्ट नॉर्थ साउथ एंड दिस नॉर्थ साउथ दिस विल बी ऑल वेस्ट पैर सो द एंगल एक्सटेंडेड फ्राम नॉर्थ साउथ टूवर्ड्स दिस लाइन दैट विल बी कार्ड फोर बेयरिंग we represent this at the end uh, by this arrow which uh, shows that uh, this line is start up from north south line towards uh, this line so for example if i say this is a theta 1 okay so what is theta 1 theta 1 shows you for bearing and now an angle x uh, in clockwise in clockwise direction extended towards this line so this angle will show you theta 2 and theta 2 means back bearing back bearing actually four bearing and back bearing is same four bearing and back bearing is uh, same so what's the difference the difference is only direction this bearing actually this is a line which uh, lying at its exact position so its position you cannot change only you are taking the bearing so if you observe it bearing from this point that will be four bearing and if you observe it for back uh, bearing from this point that will be back bearing here another question arises if you come and you want to start to find a bearing of this line and you are and past you are starting from this point so this will be then back uh, four bearing and the second reading which is taken at point at this point that will show you back bearing so actually four bearing and back bearing is same the only difference is direction the only difference is 
direction for example for example if uh, this is a uh, 20 degree okay theta 1 is 20 degree what will be big bearing big bearing will be 200 big bearing will be 200 why look at this position this is 20 degree so it means uh, this is also 20 degree because when line intersect so the, uh, these angle will be, this is a geometric principle that theta 1 if here is theta 1 here will also be theta 1 jo aamne samne jo angle hai wo barabar honge yahan pe aap dekhiye jab aap yahan se start hote hain yahan pe aate hain east ki taraf to ye 90 degree ho jata hai east se south ki taraf aate hain to ye 180 degree aa, aa jata hai to 180 plus 20 it will become 200 200 degree so it means uh, if you know one bearing, you can find the other bearing. If you know four bearing, you can find back bearing. And similarly, if you know back bearing, you can find four bearing. The only difference is uh, 180 degree. Okay. So by generally, we represent this relationship by a formula. Back bearing, that will be equal to four bearing plus minus 180 degree plus minus 180 degree so now what's the meaning of this plus one remember if you want to convert four bearing into back bearing and for example this four bearing that is a less than 180 degree for example uh, 20 degree and you want to calculate the back bearing back bearing so what will you do i will add a 180 degree I will add a, I will use a plus sign if my bearing is less than 180 degree. It's a simple calculation. For example, here is not 20, here is a 181 degree. 181 degree. So it exceeds from 180 degree. So now if I want to calculate back bearing. So what will I do? I will use a 181 degree. And here now I will use a minus sign. 180 degree. And I will get a 1 degree. And that is a Will, and that will be back bearing so this is a conversion how four bearing and back bearing are converted into each other then uh, after that i will solve uh, a problem that uh, how you will convert four bearing and uh, back bearing this conversion is in whole circle bearing whole circle bearing which is uh, from 0 to 360 degree while the reduced bearing system yeah, or in quadrantal system this the range is 0 from 90 degree so if i have four bearing 60 degree north or east 60 degree north east what will be back bearing it is very simple north south east and west and this shows you 60 degree okay 60 degree now north east and this is north south east and west So this will also be 60 degree. So in reduced bearing system, in reduced bearing system, four bearing and back, the digits are four bearing and, and back bearing will be same. Here is also come 60 degree, okay? But the only difference is a quadrant. In this first quadrant as used, and in this is a third quadrant is used southwest. Southwest. Okay, here is a another uh, question arises about uh, that uh, how you will decide uh, that it is first quadrant that is second quadrant uh, in survey north south east and west that is a uh, first quadrant second quadrant third quadrant and fourth quadrant okay while that is in survey engineering field okay engineering field while in physical sciences which include physics chemistry mathematics and all the basic sciences uh, and especially in physics we represent this as a, here we write north south and here what's it they write a y y dash 
and x axis okay x axis and y y dash and survey the main or line the main which we constructed and which we find uh, different types of uh, bearing that's with respect to this vertical line now so while in physics if you find the coordinates if you find the angles that will be with the help of this horizontal axis x axis okay if i will make uh, a line any line and i want to find the angle so that will be with respect to x axis but in survey line if i have a line so i will calculate the angle with respect to vertical line which is not south that is the difference similarly in physics in physics that is first quadrant that is second quadrant that is third quadrant and that is fourth quadrant and uh, you know the latitude and departure latitude and departure so in this first quadrant that will be positive positive in this negative positive negative negative and positive negative in this survey here will be positive positive here is a uh, only we shows you this that is that is the situation so in physics we represent this by r that is a small y and that is small x direction so it means uh, this x and this y x y point this shows you the point that is point okay the coordinate of this point is x y so we represent this uh, x y in plus plus similarly in this quadrant negative plus that is x that is y that is x that is y that is x that is y but uh, in survey we if we find the coordinates of any point for example this so or or main coordinates uh, uh, that we will the triangle will make like this one okay so this line this line this uh, will shows you what this will shows you latitude okay that is called latitude and that is a departure that is a departure why this line that is a latitude you know that uh, tangent to theta tangent to theta is equal to vertical by base vertical by base here what is the vertical here is d vertical so we will write uh, d is equal to and what's this we shows this l okay to l so this shows you the direction theta is equal to tangent inverse d by l this shows the direction of this line similarly if you write a cos theta in this so cos theta means uh, base by hypotenuse hypotenuse which means uh, what is base uh, base is represented by l capital l divided by hypotenuse is represented by small uh, that is a uh, length of this line that is a uh, length in next step uh, it will becomes a uh, l length of this survey line that will be equal to latitude cos theta okay similarly departure will be equal to departure will be equal to l sin theta d by l sorry that is capital l that is latitude and that is a length of line okay so in this uh, in physics uh, we said that physics mam kehte hai ki ye pas kya hai x y hai aur ye y hai ye coordinate hai yahan pe coordinate ko hum represent karte hai latitude aur departure ko to ye pehle kya cheez hai ye latitude hai ya departure to isme latitude aur departure dono positive ho sahi hai isme hum clockwise jate hain clockwise isme dono jo hai isme negative positive latitude and departure 
इसमें दोनों नेगेटिव लेटीट्यूड और डिपार्चर दोनों नेगेटिव और इसमें प्लस नेगेटिव लेटीट्यूड एंड डिपार्चर इन सर्वे वी गोज क्लाक वाइज फर्स्ट क्वार्टर सेकेंड थर्ड एंड फोर्थ इन फिजिक्स वी गोज एंटी क्लाक वाइज एंड और रेफरेंस लाइन इज हारिजेंटल विद वी मेजर द एंगल विद रिस्पेक्ट टू दिस एक्स एक्सेज वाइल इन इन सर्वे वी रिप्रेजेंट द एंगल ऑफ एनी लाइन विद रिस्पेक्ट टू नॉर्थ साउथ वर्टिकल लाइन वर्टिकल लाइन विच इज अ मेरेडियन लाइन ओके थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग